Hi there everybody, welcome back to another episode of Real Bizarre. I hope you all guys doing well. Today's topic is hotels. Now most people have a rough idea of what a good hotel is supposed to be and look and feel like. But the vast majority agrees that a good hotel is the one that is clean, uh, well designed, comfortable and authentic. All right. Now there are many hotels out there and they all look sort of a bit the same and they're quite mediocre frankly speaking. So what I suggest we do is we focus our attention on some of the most interesting and unusual guest houses from around the world. Would you take a look at this cuteness? Soaps and lotions were supplemented by Ducky. How lovely. It's a good thing. Having a bath all alone is just too depressing. Many Chinese hotels are very thoughtful. They provide their guests with a kind of cards they can use to show taxi drivers. This way they don't experience any language barriers. This hotel took it a little bit further. It's got a whole spouse disposal unit. I wonder how many times it was utilized. Now this one guy asked Hampton Hotel staff to bring him the whole fort. Now it turned out that those people had a great sense of humor. And they came up with some pretty funny stuff. They also came up with some rules they especially printed out for the fort master. Here's what it said. Always be loyal to Fort Hampton. Defend the fort at all costs. It's your hope. Remove shoes before entering the fort. No passing gas in the fort. It's a small space with limited air supply. Follow fort rules at all times or thou shalt be banished to a fortless wasteland for all eternity. And this hotel lets you use various inputs to plug in your devices. Now that's what you call environmental awareness. The soap pack that says Take your soap home. Tons of slightly used bar soaps are discarded daily by hotels. If you choose to take your soap home, a usable product won't be wasted. That's a very unusual hostel in Germany where you live in a vintage trailer. And that's a very creative type of weather report. Coconut moving, windy. Coconut still, calm. Coconut wet, rainy. Coconut dry, sunny. Coconut white snow. Coconut invisible fog. Coconut gone hurricane. I would only add one more. Coconut talking to you. Go see a doctor. These curtains are very cleverly designed. You can shut the whole window without leaving any cracks of light. For good tips in Egypt hotels you get bed sheet wonders like this. And in this instance, room service lady found some sunglasses and let the guests notice it by assembling an elephant out of pillows. I wonder if she'd do if she would have found something much less decent. Evacuation plan right by the floor. Well, I guess it makes it easier to look at when the whole premises is up in smoke. This is an elevator. And that little thing in the corner is an emergency toilet. How thoughtful. The best shampoo you will ever steal. Really makes you want to steal it, yeah? So why do you guys think there's one black little towel among all the white ones? Alright, you have 10 seconds to think about an answer to that. And go. Alright, so here's the answer. The black towel is a makeup removal towel. I bet a lot of women will find it very thoughtful. Look, there's one extra mini room in this hotel. It's for kids, and it looks pretty cool. Although that entry kind of reminds you of a coffin. That's a bit creepy, don't you think so? And in this one, you can take a plan to your room so that you don't feel lonely. How sweet. 
In this hotel you can find the rag in every room. Wanna know what it's for? Have a look what it has to say. I'm the rag. I may be stained and torn, but I'm clean. I can be used to clean up the most stubborn items such as coffee, makeup, oil or mud. If you require more of the rag, please contact the front desk. Thank you for saving our bright white towels. Check out this shower you guys. Here you can turn the water on first, adjust it and then go inside. Now I know that some hotels are extra cautious when it comes to safety, but this stair climbing instruction is a little bit over the edge of reason. One of the guests asked to hide the photo of Robert Downey Jr. in his room. At some point he forgot about it and was very happy to find it when he went to take a bath after a long bad day. In this hotel they're happy to see people from all over the world. There are all kinds of sockets, you see, so people don't have to worry about adapters. Check it out you guys, an autonomous robot that delivers drinking water right to your door. And did you know that some hotels offer smartphones with free calls and internet? How cool is that? This type of stuff you don't see every day. And this hotel in the center of London has genuine beehives on its roof. Hmm, I wonder how much liquid you should drink to be able to read the whole paper while you're doing number one. Sweet Tooth Dream heated Nutella in a hotel in Luxembourg. A bathtub right on the balcony. Why the hell not? The view's great. And in this hotel, soap looks just like shredded parmesan cheese. I'm not really sure if this thing's useful, but it says that this sound masking technology improves the comfort of your room. Apparently, it makes you sleep like a baby. Room numbers as shadows. Looks very interesting. Additional elevator button you can press on your way to the left. That's genius. It's like you step to it and it's already there. A former railway station is now a very cozy hotel. Now how do you like this shining style bath? It creates very interesting atmosphere, doesn't it? Lighting and rug pattern in this corridor makes you feel like you're tripping. And another brave solution. Water drips down right from the ceiling. This smart mirror tells you what's the weather like outside, in case you've forgotten to look out your window. There's a real tree right in the middle of this hotel room. Those cabinets contain frequently used items that people often lack when they're far away from home. The smear in, in one of the Japanese hotels has a module that prevents it from fogging up. How do you like this view? Well, it's actually not what it seems. Once you come closer to the window, you're up for a surprise. Well, you know, at least they try to improve things a little. In this hotel, the cat's the manager, so all complaints that you have you're gonna have to take to the cat. What's funny about this pool is that one half of it is in Nevada and another one is in California. So you can brag about how you swam all the way from California to Nevada and back. Wow, this reception desk looks awfully nice. I think it's probably one of the best I saw so far. What a trippy carpet, put you in a trance. Imagine how you feel walking on a trunk of your tits. And this elevator is, in fact, a karaoke bar. Well, I guess handlebars are better than the heads and horns of real animals. 
That little thread is amazing. You just pull it and it switches off all the lights in the room. Staff members of this Japanese hotel are sorry for the internet connection was lost for a single minute at 4 o'clock in the morning. Now that's what I call respect. Uh, perhaps you didn't know, but there are hotels out there that let you use their electric guitars. That's pretty... that's pretty hardcore. This elevator floor in one of the hotels in Odessa reminds you what day it is. How smart. And in this hotel, you can have breakfast in what used to be a bank vault. In some hotels, TVs are built into bathroom mirrors. People probably spend more time in bathrooms like that. After a major construction work, personnel of this hotel offered their guests chocolate hammers to make it up for him. How sweet! After a long flight, this hotel in Netherlands offers you a refreshing caffeine shot. And you know what keeps me going, guys? I get kicks when you smile watching my videos. That's right! This is it for now. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.